Oh, hands down the coolest thing we've got. Hands down. I know that signature very, very well. So many people to thank. And know that, like, like you said, this is this is only the beginning. Welcome back to Card Shop. Thousands of people, collections, card shops, and collectors. Forty-seven five. You're, you're good to go. All right, man. <laughs> a lot of time ahead and a lot of opportunity to, to, to make this place special every day. So, all right, what's going on, YouTube? Card Collector Two coming at you here with a brand new video. And today we are back with another box break, but this one is much larger than before. Today we're gonna rip another box of Leaf Vault. We've done this once on the channel and unfortunately we did not have a ton of success. We ripped one of these in the past where we got 10 random memorabilia pieces, but the first box unfortunately was not our best. We hit a Chelsea Clinton and Hillary Clinton signed book, a Damon Stoudemire signed jersey, a Big Sean uh, signed poster, uh, a Buster Posey baseball was probably the best hit. Unfortunately, it was not the best one. So hopefully uh, we've got some redemption here and hopefully there's a little bit of, uh, hopefully there's something cooler in this box than what we had last time. I think the most unique piece last time was like a Paul Rudd uh, so or like worn item from a movie set. Uh, I think that was one of the cooler ones. Again, the Buster Posey. Um, we had a Dick Vitale like autograph trading card. So we'll see. But again, 10 random memorabilia pieces inside. Hopefully there's something really, really nice in here. All right, let's see what we got. As always, it's filled to the brim with peanuts. Tons and tons of peanuts. Right there. All right. Well, time to start digging before I get this everywhere again. All right, well, I see a mini helmet, a sneaker, a poster, all sorts of different stuff. So let me cut this open and we'll just grab something out. All right, so we got a sneaker. I don't know what on earth this is. It's a shoe. I think we got this last time. I'm almost positive we got the exact same one. It was probably the left. This is the right. It's a cleat. It's got the Fanatics hollow on it. Uh, yeah, it is. It's the exact same one. James Blake. I think we probably got the left. We got the matching pair. Uh, the matching pair of James Blake tennis shoes. I think he's a tennis player. But it's a Nike Air Max Breathe model shoe. It is autographed. Has a Fanatic cert. Has a Steiner cert as well. So it's double certed. Not necessarily what we're after, but I guess could be worse. All right, we've got a mini helmet here, Dallas Cowboys. That's Randy White, I think. I'm almost positive that's Randy White. Randy White signed mini helmet for the Dallas Cowboys. Uh, these retail, I think, for about $1,300 typically when they come out. So you got to average about $130 an item. I'm not sure James Blake and Randy White are going to get us there, but hopefully there's something bigger inside. Got a signed baseball here. Oh, not bad. Well, would have probably been better if we were to rip this when we got this product. Uh, that's Fernando Tatis. Fernando Tatis Jr. signed autograph baseball. Be interesting to see what the rest of his career looks like after getting busted for PED use. But that's a B, uh, JAS signed autograph baseball. All right, we've got an autograph jersey. Jim Palmer, I believe, yeah, J it says Palmer. Uh, Jim Palmer, autographed Orioles jersey. Not much of a baseball guy, but it's kind of cool. Autographed jerseys, we always move those. All right, got another one. Got a couple more autographed jerseys. Uh, who is this? Billy, Sh looks like Billy Shaw. I don't know much about Billy Shaw, if that's who that is. Says Shaw, looks like the Bills or Giants. All right, another one. Well, that's cool, one of the best collegiate uh, Athletes I've seen college football players ever. Vince Young signed Texas jersey. That uh, 2005 Rose Bowl or 2006 Rose Bowl, I guess. Iconic, absolutely uh, incredible collegiate career. All right, looks like we got a flag here. Hopefully this is something cool. It looks like it's a Masters flag. Oh, hands down the coolest thing we've got. Hands down. I know that signature very, very well. That is a Jack Nicholas. Masters flag, uh, Ohio State alum, Columbus legend. 
It has a full letter from PSA. Uh, so that is by far, by far the coolest thing we have received in either of these leaf breaks, uh, these uh, leaf vault cases. Super, super cool. That's incredible. Love that. We'll have to get that framed up. By far my favorite piece so far. Now we got some signed memory or some signed photos. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, John Wall 8x10. Fanatics authenticated. Not who we're after. <laughs> Coach O. 8x10. LSU Tiger. Uh, I couldn't try to mimic his voice if I tried. I'm certainly not deep enough to do that. But when I walk through the goalposts there, I raise my hands up and I feel like I'm connected to 102,500 people. It's got a 19 and 19 champs inscription on it. So that's kind of cool if you're a LSU Tiger fan. And then we got a big photo. Ah, another one that works well locally. Actually pretty cool auto as well. So let's see if I can get this out of here. I don't want to crease it. All right, it's definitely gonna need to be framed, but it's actually a really cool photo. Really, really cool photo. I could get it out. All right, 1963 Rookie of the Year inscription with the blue ink, that is Pete Rose. So Pete Rose, what's that, 16 by 20 it looks like. Really, really cool photo, that turned out really nice. Love the blue, ins the blue ink, looks great. Really cool photo, got the PSA cert. So yeah, that is, I think that's all of it. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. I don't think there's anything else in here, just a bunch of packing peanuts. Yeah, all right. Well, it all fit in this bag last this time. We ripped a couple of these in the past. They've had bats and stuff that didn't fit. But yeah, in my opinion, this one was better than the last one. Last one had, the, again, the Paul Rudd, the book, Damon Stoudemire. I think it's definitely a mix of stuff. You've got stuff like, to me, this this doesn't do me any good. John Wall, like he hasn't played in, in Washington in years. Like Billy Shaw, I don't even know who that is. Um, James Blake Shoe. But it's got, it had a lot better names this time, I feel like. Jack Nicholas, Pete Rose, Fernando Tatis. Vince Young, Randy White, I, I think those are those are bigger names. So overall felt pretty good. I think it was a cool box, and I think it's just it's one of the more unique products in the industry that you just there's not a lot of stuff out there that you can rip and get 10 signed memorabilia pieces like this. So very cool. Hopefully we'll do another one of these soon. I think we have another one of these cases put back. So we'll see. But for now, guys, that's all I've got. Peace.